What's up guys, this is Cody back with a closer look at the Adidas Torsion Edberg Comp in its original colorway. Now the Edberg silhouette debuted in 1990 as a signature shoe for Swedish tennis player Stefan Edberg. Adidas brought it back for the first time since its original release to celebrate the 30th anniversary of the Adidas Torsion System. For those of you that don't know, the torsion system is this little plastic bar that connects the forefoot and heel, allowing them to move more independently and making the whole shoe a little more flexible. I, did this really work? Like, I can't really flex that. Either way, they've used it a lot. It's been used countless times since it debuted in the late 1980s, and it still exists in a modified form on the most recent Ultra Boost. But that's enough about the torsion system. This Edberg comp released exclusively at Adidas Consortium accounts on July 19th, 2019, for a retail price of $120. Now let's get into the shoe. On the lateral side, a very light gray leather is used on a majority of the upper. It's not white, it's a very light gray leather that works well with the off-white midsole to give it a slightly aged look. Three multicolored rubberized stripes accent the mid-panel above an off-white EVA foam midsole with dark purple accents. The medial side is symmetrical to the lateral side. At the top of the shoe, the light gray leather toe box features embroidered and perforated detailing in front of a small strip of purple neoprene that allows the shoe to flex more naturally. Tonal flat laces run over a perforated leather tongue, while the top of the tongue features a patterned mesh with embroidered Adidas branding. The shoe is lined in purple and blue fleece with a light gray insole that features this unique thick print at the heel. The rubber outsole is executed in purple, blue, and gum brown with the iconic Adidas torsion bar in yellow. At the back of the shoe, light gray leather wraps around purple neoprene, the same neoprene from the toe box. Adidas Torsion branding is printed in blue, above blue and purple leather, and the off-white EVA midsole. The shoes come packaged in an Adidas Consortium pull-out box. On feet, the Torsion Edberg is surprisingly comfortable. The insole features responsive cushioning, and the combination of the EVA foam midsole and rubber outsole keeps the shoe lightweight but still durable. For sizing, I recommend going with your standard Adidas size. And that'll wrap up this closer look at the Adidas Torsion Edberg Comp in its original colorway. I was intrigued by the silhouette when it first released last July, but it wasn't selling well, so I waited for it to hit sale before I grabbed a pair. Eventually, I got them for 50% off, and at $60, this is a pretty good shoe. I've been wearing Reebok Club C's a lot recently, and this is a similar court shoe with a unique silhouette that, in my opinion, looks incredible on feet. I think I'll be wearing these a lot in 2020. In the comments below, let me know your thoughts on the Adidas Edberg. Would you grab a pair for 60 bucks? And stay tuned for a closer look at the highs and lows collaboration on the Edberg silhouette that takes an already good shoe and makes it even better. Until next time, this has been Cody Template and the Adidas Torsion Edberg Comp. Thanks for watching. Quick wardrobe change, and they'll never know I shot this right after the last one.